Hey folks, this is Vince and Natalie with Dad's Gaming Addiction, and today we're going to play Stratego. This is the Fire and Ice edition that I featured on my channel before. It plays like standard Stratego, except that every character has a special ability. But what we're going to do, this is Idalee's first time playing. We're going to play a regular game of Stratego, and then if there's time, we'll go ahead and play with the special abilities, or make that a separate video. So, what are you doing in Stratego? For those of you that have no idea what this is all about, it's a two-player game. Um, the box says it's for ages 8 and up. I don't know if I agree with it, but, you know, it, it's a fairly thinky kind of game. And it lasts roughly around half an hour to an hour. Your objective is to capture the enemy flag. This is a hidden information game. I've got my forces set up, and only I can see what I have set up on my side of the board. And likewise, I cannot see what Ida Lee's armies are like. There are numbers and symbols and different things on all of these pieces. Um, I want to go ahead and zoom in slightly just so you can see the bottom row here. So there's numbers 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. In this version of Stratego, 10 is the highest. It's the best piece possible. It can only be taken out by the S, or the Slayer. Now, there are multiple renditions of Stratego, so your rules may vary. In the old school Stratego that I owned as a kid, the one was the Marshal or the Admiral, something like that, and he was the best out of everything. So in this rendition, 10 is the best, and 2 is like your weak scout unit. And the S Slayer here is the only piece that can take out the 10. In this case, it's a dragon. Um, any other piece can take out the Slayer. The Slayer is weak to everyone else. Anyone that touches it will die. Um, if the Slayer attacks anything else but a 10, it'll die. So you gotta keep this guy protected so that you can possibly take out the enemy 10 throughout the game. There are some other things. There's a flag. The flags, is that you have one flag, and that is your special piece. If you lose it, if, you get, if it gets attacked, you're done, game over. There are traps situated on the board. Um, traps are things that you set up. They do not move, like your flag, they do not move. If an opponent runs into them, no matter what number it is or what symbol, whatever, it's dead. Now, the only piece that can take out a trap is the dwarf, that's the number three. So if a three were to run into a trap, the trap would go away and the three would remain. But any other piece that touches a trap is dead. So you gotta try and keep your threes alive if you can, if your opponent still has a lot of traps on the board. In the game, basically on your turn, you're gonna choose one piece and you're going to move it one space orthogonally. One space up, down, left, or right. The exception is the scout, which can move as many spaces as it wants, up, down, left, or right. But once you do that, then your opponent knows, hey, that's a scout. So, you know, it's up to you on whether or not you wanna reveal that information right away, or if you don't care and you're just trying to find out. Now, whenever you move a piece onto an enemy piece, you both reveal, and whoever has the higher number in this case wins the battle. Higher number stays on that spot, the other one gets removed from the game. If they are the same number, they both get annihilated, um, and in other situations like the Slayer, different things will happen. Okay? So, um, I think we are ready to, to give this a go. Um, so, would you like to go first? You're going to pick one piece. Uh, these are dead zones, you cannot move into them. So only here, here, there's three lanes basically. Okay. And again, your objective is to find my flag and take it, if you can. Okay, so I know that that's not a bomb, because, or in this case a trap, because she moved it. So that's one, that's, again, these are different pieces of information that are helpful to me. Um, I'm going to go ahead and use my scout to move as many spaces as I want and attack it. So I'm gonna reveal and see what it is. This is a six, so I know it's a six. Mine is a two, obviously, because I moved. So six beats a two, this goes back into the box. But now I know that's a six. I gotta remember that, though. It's not, it's not permanent information, I have to remember that. Okay, so now it is your turn again. Um, and I'm, what I'm gonna do, to, so you guys can actually see, I'm gonna go ahead and move the camera up because I don't think you got you don't guys don't need to see the abilities down below because we're not using them right now. So pardon me while I get this camera figured out here. All right, I'm trying to get as close as I can. Hopefully you guys can see all that. All right, and straighten her out just a smidge. Okay. All right, cool. So you moved that up, right? Okay. So I'm gonna go ahead and do something like this. Okay. 
scout. You're gonna use your scout. That is a two, or that is a seven. That's so yours, yes. Yeah, so your two goes away. So now you know that that's a seven. Mm -hmm. And now I get to go. So I'm gonna go ahead and do something like this. And she's moving back. All right, I'm gonna do something like this. Now her reaction here may tell me something. I know, right? <laughs> if she doesn't move it, then there may be a piece near it that can take it after I take her. So, but she might be bluffing. Maybe there isn't a piece that can take me back. This is a, this is a huge bluffing game, yeah. this is. What does she have? She's moving up, okay. Um, I'm going to go ahead and move um, this piece up. Mm -hmm. I'm going to scout this. All right, that is a two, and that's a two. So we annihilated each other. Now it's your turn. Uh, yep, now it's my turn. I'm going to go ahead and scout that piece. Okay. That's a two. It's a three. A three. Okay, so your three stays there. Good. All right. I have a terrible memory, just for the record. Uh, I'll scout that was a, it's also a two, so we both <laughs> annihilate each other. Okay. I will go ahead and move um, this piece up. I'll move this one. All right. I will do that. And actually, let's do, whoops. I don't want to kill my own guy here. That would be bad. Um, let's yeah, let's go ahead and do that. It's fine. Mhm. Mm All right. I'm gonna do this. Mhm. Mm uh, oh. That's a six. Yeah. Right, that's my. That's a seven. Yeah. Okay. I, 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 I wasn't that. sure what that was. I wanted to... I'm just kidding. Uh, okay. <laughs> I see. I your, mouth, your mouth dropped like... Um, oh, no. Hmm. It's okay. Okay. Um, I'm going to do this. <laughs> Rough. All right, I'm going to attack. Okay. That is a four. That was a three. Okay. I'm going to attack. Okay, what is that? A seven. A seven, wow, okay. Got me there. All right, I'm going to go ahead and move uh, this piece over. I'm going to move this piece over. Okay, I'm going to do that. I'm going to do that. Ah, scouting, that's a nine. It's your turn, isn't it? It is my turn. I'm going to do this. I'm going to zoom in just real quick so you guys can see a little bit better what I got. All right, what did you do? You move this over? Okay. That tells me that you might have something good there. I don't know. Um, I'm going to go ahead and move this piece up. Hmm, indeed. Mm -hmm. Alright, I kind of have to. What is that? A nine. Ten. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> that was good. Bam! <laughs> that was really good. No, nah, I wasn't sure. I wasn't sure what that was. I. Uh, see, you just moved that up. There's a possibility that you might take that. Um, and now that might be a ten. But the question is, would she have put her 9 and 10 in the same area? I don't know. Or she, is she bluffing? Um, hmm. <laughs> All 
All right, I'm going to do this. I'm just going to move this over, actually. Okay. And if you want to take that, you can take that seven. Hmm. <sighs> All right. I think I know what she's doing. This is my, this is my thought, okay? <laughs> One of these is a slayer. As soon as she takes this, I take back, she takes my 10. That's what I'm guessing. So I'm gonna go ahead and make a preemptive move and attack that. What is that? Six. Six, that's a seven, okay. <laughs> Ooh, interesting. All right, I'm going to do that. I don't know what that is. I don't want to risk it. Uh, you're moving over, huh? Um, that could be an eight. She might be trying to do the same thing. Um, all right, I'm going to move uh, this up, actually. Hmm. Is she bluffing? What is what is going on here? Crap. All right. Um. It's a great thing that you don't know my strategy because I don't know my strategy. I see. <laughs> I'm gonna um. Let me this guy up. Hmm. Okay. I'm gonna attack this. What is that? Four. Seven. Okay. I'm going to bring this up. It could be anything. I'm going to move this down. A lot happening over there on that side of the board. All right, I'm going to find out what this is. What is that? Ten. Ten. Ooh, nasty. Okay. She's got her... 10 over there. Okay. That was a good move on your part. You got a 7 out of me. Mm. Okay. <laughs> I guess. Um, it's my turn. It is your turn. Moving up. Okay. Um, let's Do um, I'm gonna do something like hmm. I have a feeling that I'm just gonna do that because I know what it isn't. Okay. Um. Oh, this is tough. Tough McGruff. Um, I'm gonna go... Well... I could get a piece out of that, at least. Assuming... Assuming... Alright, you know what? I'm gonna yellow that. What is that? A seven. Nine. Because I know where your ten is, so it's like... Yeah. But I don't know where your nine is. That's the thing. Oh, she's moving forward. Okay. Um, that tells me that I could be in trouble. I'm going to do that for the moment. Trying to force a trade on me, I see, um, but I'd rather 
gain momentum. So if she wants the 10, she can have it. Because I know that's the 10. So I'm going to do that instead. Hmm. Moving forward, okay, I'm going to do that. And down. <laughs> I don't know what that is. It could be a two for all I know, and I'm running away from a two. I don't know. Oh, she's moving up. Okay. Um, part of me just wants to attack it to see what it is. <laughs> but... Wow, okay. Um, all right. Let's do that. It's a five. An eight. An eight, nasty. Okay, so there goes my five. Um, I'm going to go ahead and do this yep. eight. <laughs> Mutual annihilation. But you got a you got a piece out of me. That's yeah. good. Okay. Um I'm going to I'm gonna move uh this one forward. Hmm, interesting. I'll do that. What is that? A seven. That's a trap. Ah, mother thing. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Ooh. Now, the fact that she's coming down this lane like that, I have a feeling she's going to be trying to release release the hounds, get her dwarves down there to take out that trap. <laughs> we'll see. Ooh. Okay. So now I have a choice. I kind of have to. All right. I got a ten. No. All right. So our tens are gone. <laughs> That's it. The, the strongest piece on the board right now are nines, so, um, let's do, um, That's a four. Eight. An eight. Nasty. Nice job. So that goes here. Nice job. Your turn? Yeah, it is my turn. Um, okay. This is getting cutthroat. <laughs> um, seven? Five. Okay. Okay. Wow. All right, I got it. I think 
trying to paint me. Bait you? Mm -hmm. Why would I do that? You can't have me! <laughs> I see. I see. I okay. Now what is this? Trap. <laughs> Three. Okay. So you're gone. Oh yeah, that's right. I forgot about that. Yeah. That's okay. Interesting. Um, oh, dog. Well, I don't know what that is, but uh, I can't really do much about it. Okay, um, <laughs> well then, all right, I, I will take the bait. What is that? Seven. Seven. My turn. It is your turn. that one interesting um Oh, yeah, sorry. Got real aggressive. I got, I got excited. I see. I see you got excited. Um, let's do that. I think I know what you're trying to do. Do you? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> what is that? Three. Seven. Those miners, like those dwarves, yeah. I, I know them as miners. They are weak in the beginning, but at the end they can become crucial because uh, yeah, because be all those traps. Right, and stuff. right. Your nine is still out there somewhere. I'm just saying. Okay. Um. Let's do that. As a trap. A three, nice. Oh, yeah. Okay, so it stays there. Mm -hmm. I will fight back. I got a five. Mm hmm. Hmm. Well, 
Wow. Okay. Which one is the nine? I gotta know. I gotta know. Um, I gotta know which one's the nine. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I got a eight. Eight. Yeah, I figured just to get out of the way. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, interesting. So you move that one. Okay. Um. <laughs> I just noticed something. What? <laughs> okay. I'll tell you after. I see. <sighs> uh, you can't tell me, obviously, because yeah. that would that would ruin. That's okay. That's my fault. Uh, that is a trap, but you just knocked it out with a three. Good Sorry. job. No, you're fine. I'm going to use my five and knock that. Well, I gotta do it. What is that? It's a five. Uh, <laughs> nine. Okay. Interesting. Yeah. What is that? A four. That's a three. You got it. Oh, yeah. You got it. Oh, well, you've been baiting me that entire time with a four? <laughs> yeah. Wow. Good move. Good move. Okay. Yeah, but I, I kind of messed myself up. Sometimes you trap yourself uh, yeah. unintentionally. Uh, okay. Gotta pay attention to what's what. Um, I gotta know what this is. What is that? <sighs> What is that? My S. My S2. Oh, that wow. Was, yeah, I mean, once the 10 is gone and you yeah. stole the Slayer, there's no purpose other than to scout yeah. with him. All right, well, that's one piece gone. So it's your turn, because I, I did that. Seven. Yeah, this is a four. Okay. Is it your turn? Uh, no, I just took you, right? I thought I landed on Oh, you. did you land on me? Okay. I thought I did. Okay. Go ahead. Um... You've got eight, seven pieces left. One of them's the flag, probably in the back corner. Um, let's just, uh, but here's the thing. I gotta, gotta be careful about stuff. Because... <laughs> what? I'm sorry. What's wrong with you? No, 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 I'll tell you after. All right. Um, <laughs> okay, let's do, uh, Let's do something. Actually, no, let's do this. Okay. What happens if you can't move anymore? <laughs> um. If you can't move anymore? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Did you trap your knife? I trapped something. <laughs> I trapped. Okay. Um, good point. Um, if, you can, uh, if all of your movable pieces have been captured and you cannot move or attack, you must surrender. Okay. So I you surrender. You surrender. All right. So I'm the not only one that I have. These were all traps except for this one and this one. This was the flag. Oh. This was my dwarf. I didn't have a nine this whole time because you caught it in the beginning. I forgot about that, didn't mm -hmm. I? Oh, I forgot. Yeah. Crap. So okay. I was holding you at bay with a four. It was really <laughs> funny. <laughs> good. That's good. My memory is absolutely horrible. Yeah. I'm just going to say that right now. And so I, I trapped my only person that could move with all these traps by accident in the beginning of the game. <laughs> That's awesome. Good job. Now, the standard rule, like, there's a couple of rules. Um, you can do one of two things with the captured pieces. You can lay them face down so that no one knows what you've taken, which is what we did. I just basically, yeah, sort of. um, yeah, they're just sort of scattered in there. Another option is lay them face up so that everyone can see what's been taken so far mm. more friendly. Another option is your opponent. Like I can take your pieces and know what you've got or, or you can take the pieces that I've captured. It's yeah, either way. It like, is. so it's either hidden information on the captured side or revealed information. Mm -hmm. So, um, what did you think of the standard game? It was okay. It was okay? Would you play this again, or...? I'm curious to know what the abilities, how it would differ, like, mm -hmm. the whole game. Alright, well, why don't we, um, take a time out then, and see what these abilities do, and then we'll set up for a new game. So I'm gonna move the camera back, actually.
and I'm going to zoom in as much as possible. We already know what those three do, so I'm going to come over here. Okay, so the special abilities for the special game. The dragon has flight. When you, you have to reveal it, well, you may reveal and then fly over any number of occupied squares in a straight line and land on the first empty space. Mm. So if you had, um, where is, well, I don't have, let's say that, I don't know if my 10 is in here, so it should be. Let's say that this was my 10, it's not. Mm -hmm. But I, I can also fly over this the too. Empty space. I, can, the... I can fly over this as well. Oh, wow. But I, if I can fly over pieces and then I have to land, I reveal it and I land on the first empty spot, in this mm. case, something like that. And then after I do that, I can attack. Oh, cool. Mm -hmm. Wow. Um, so that was the 10. There's actually a guide here. I can bring that out too. Um, okay. Yeah, flight. Gives the fire-breathing dragon and the arctic dragon frostbite the ability to glide over any number of adjacent pieces in a straight line and land on the first empty square. So basically it can jump over things in a straight line. Once it's landed, it may then go on to make a conventional attack uh, on the adjacent square. Mm -hmm. The um, mage detect enemy may reveal, then force an enemy up to two squares away in any direction to reveal. Mm -hmm. So I can reveal my nine and go two spaces away. I want you to tell me what you are so it can detect what you are. Cool. The eight is a knight, has quickness, may reveal, then move two squares in any direction except diagonally, may not jump over pieces. So it's mm -hmm. kind of like the scout, but it can move twice. Like it can, but you now, have to reveal it. It says may reveal. Are these all optional? Optional. These are all optional. You do not have to do their special abilities if you don't want to. I see. So, do you have to reveal in order to use their special yes. ability? Yes. If, if you want to use their special abilities, you have to reveal what they are. I see. Okay. The beast rider is uh, quickness as well. Um, may reveal, then move two squares in any direction, except diagonally, may not jump over pieces. The sorceress enchant may reveal, then choose an enemy within two squares. If lower ranked, the enemy changes sides. So that means if I can, I can enchant a 5, 4, 3, 2, or a uh, slayer. Mm. Um, I believe the slayer. And it, I, it flips over to my side, and then I use it for the rest of the game. You cannot enchant it back. Okay. Mm-hmm. Okay. Does that make any sense? Yeah, it does. Um, can you, what happens if you reveal a trap? Uh, the trap, uh, it ha I think, I don't think that counts as a number, though. That's not technically a rank. Mm. If, if it is equal or higher rank, nothing happens. Um, it cannot, okay, na, 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 na. you can enchant over forbidden zones, slayers may be enchanted, but traps and flags cannot. So I can enchant your, your slayer, but I cannot enchant a, um, a flag or a trap. Okay. It's a pretty nasty piece. Yes. Um, then there's Yeti, which is, uh, may move to an adjacent empty square. Then reveal and then attack all adjacent pieces. The yeti. The yeti. They're well, uh, well, mine is a yeti. Yours oh, is something else. Oh, interesting. They're named differently. They have the same abilities, but they're just named differently. Okay. Mine's ice oriented. Yours is fire oriented. Ugh, I love a beast. No, lover beast. There lava, you go. Lava. Lava. I thought you said lover beast. I'm like, how romantic. A lover beast. Okay. Because that's fire. Right? I see. You're right. The elf um, arrow strike may reveal, then attack an enemy up to two moves or two squares away in any direction. So, if if the attack is successful, then you kill him. Um, if it's, it has to be, I think, greater. Let me see. Um, yeah, if it's linked, so if if you reveal a three two or or slayer, then it's dead. If you reveal a four five six seven eight nine or ten, nothing happens. Oh, really? There's no counterattack. Wow. Mm -hmm. okay. The arrow, that arrow strike lets you attack from range without taking any risk of dying. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, and that's all of the abilities that come in the special game. Mm -hmm. So um, I'm going to go ahead and charge the camera up and we can maybe set up for another one and we'll be right back. Mm -hmm. Okay, so here we go. Round two. We're going to be playing with all of the special abilities.
This is going to be a new one for us, so uh, bear with us as we attempt to get through all of this craziness. Mm -hmm. All right, so uh, would you like to go first? I went first last time. You can go first. Great. Making me go first. <laughs> all right, so I will just... Um, hmm. Uh, um, okay, let's do, let's do that. Okay. I am going to... And what I'm going to do, folks, I'm actually going to zoom in so you guys can actually see a little bit better. And straighten this out a bit. There we go. Hopefully you guys can see all that. If you attack a scout, uh -huh. do you both get revealed, right? So okay. just scout versus scout, they both eliminate each other. Yeah. Well, I was okay. I guess I would have. It's tough. Okay. <laughs> hmm. Let's go with... Alright, let's just find out what that is. What is that? A four. Okay, two. Okay, so you beat it. Okay. Alright, so you get to go. Yeah, okay. <laughs> it's nasty. Yeah, this is hard. Um, I want to find out what this one is. Alright, that is an eight. Ooh, it's a two. Let's okay. Alright. Now it's your turn? Yeah. Um... Let's do that. Um... That is a five, and it's your two, okay. Yeah. I'll go here. Uh, okay, hold on. <laughs> take your time. I'm reading the abilities now. That's all right, take your time. This is gonna be crazy. Yeah, it is. Um. Two. 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 All right. I'm going to reveal okay. the sorceress. Okay. You may reveal, then choose an enemy within two squares. If lower ranked, the enemy changes sides. Okay. I know that that's a four, so yeah. Yeah. I now change sides. Oh, I thought it was change sides, like switch. No, it now becomes mine, and now I can use it. Oh, really? Mm-hmm. What did you think that meant? I thought that meant like... Switch positions? Yeah, switch positions. Oh, no. That means I control it now, and you cannot... Captured pieces like that or enchanted cannot be enchanted back, so you have to kill it in oh, order to get rid of it. Oh, interesting. So you can move it, you can use it, and everything? Yes. Oh, heck no. <laughs> heck no. Um... Does she have a counterattack? Like, if it's higher... If I, if I, if you did that with a higher, with a higher rank. It's all, I can only capture, I can only do that to five, four, threes, and twos, and spies. If it's higher, do I defeat you, or what? No, it's just. It just doesn't work? It just doesn't work. Okay. 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 Interesting. All right. Then I'll do this then. Go ahead. Oh, boy. Gee, I wonder what that's going to be. Okay, so I'm going to use... Um, I'm going to use this elf to reveal. 
and arrow strike may reveal and attack an enemy up to two squares away in any direction, including diagonally. I'm going to attack that diagonally. Up to two? Oh, wow. So, what is it? It's a... Oh, Slayer. Okay, so I kill it. Wow. <laughs> okay, that was lucky. That's insane. So, how am I supposed to capture a flag? I won't be able to. Ever. I, why not? I thought that was the only thing that could No, the, the Slayer is the only one that can capture the ten. Oh. Anything can capture a flag. Oh. Okay. Oh, interesting. Okay. So now my 10 yeah. is impervious, except for whatever abilities may I'm gonna kill it. reveal this. Alright, that's your elf. Now two squares away? Is yeah. it, well, that's, that's three squares. Dang it! Okay, then I'll go up. I, I figured, I figured. There's no way I can stop it. Alright. No matter what, I mean... So, um... Yeah, I gotta learn how to count. <laughs> <laughs> I will reveal this again, uh -huh. and shoot. Two, two spaces that way. What is that? Seven. Seven. Okay, so no, no damage. No, no damage. nothing happens. Okay, now I will reveal and shoot up to two away. Yep, that, that was a scout. It is dead. Okay. Alright. Um, crazy. It is nuts. I will move my four over <laughs> here. <laughs> <laughs> Um, it's gonna take pot shots. Really? This elf is single-handedly gonna win my war. It's Legolas, basically. Okay, no. so I'm going to um, let's see. I'm going to reveal my five. Mm-hmm. I can move one space to an adjacent empty square, then reveal and simultaneously attack all adjacent squares. Nice. So I'm going to move here mm -hmm. and attack all adjacent squares. That is a this four, one, yeah. right? So Nasty. Yeah. That's his rage or rampage ability. Alright. I'm going to reveal my eight. Oh, good. And move two squares in any direction except diagonally. Yep. So Bam! Can... He's, that five is out. Nasty business there. Okay, good job. It's rough. I will move one piece up. Hmm. <laughs> <Huh>. <laughs> this is hard. Yeah, it is. Um. I'm trying to remember what you have, but. I will I reveal my four and shoot this. What is that? That's a trap. A trap. Okay, so nothing happens. It's a trap. It's a trap! <laughs> <laughs> um. Hmm. Jeez. Jeez Louise. I'm gonna reveal this and move up here. Whoa! Okay. <laughs> okay. Now you can attack. It's up I to can? You. Well, yeah, but what the flight does, um, again, let me just read the thing. It just says move to I, That's what it says here, but in the rule book, it says, um, once the dragon has landed on an empty square, it may then go on to make a conventional attack against an enemy piece in an adjacent square. Oh, okay. So can I attack that? You absolutely can. What is it? That is an eight. Good job. You murdered it. So you have to move here now. Oh, I see. Okay. Oh, really? Mm-hmm. Oh, interesting. Because you made an attack. Okay. Um, I'm going to reveal my elf mm -hmm. and shoot that. Diagonally. It's a yeah. seven. Seven. Okay. All right, you've got two sevens and a trap there. Okay, interesting. Alright, my turn. Yes. Wow, this is gonna get nasty real quick. Yeah, it is. Although, 
I don't know what you have, that's the problem. I'm scared, like I was <laughs> dying to do things, but I'm scared. Alright, I'm going to reveal Okay. and then fly all the way back. Okay, I figured. Alright. Um let's do Um, where would your, uh, boy, okay, um, I'm going to do this, interesting, I will do this. Hmm. I'm going to reveal this. Okay. What? And... Oh, okay. A six? The sorceress, yeah. Okay, nice. That's a four. Okay. So you capture it. It is now yours to command. Alright, now it's your turn. Nasty. <laughs> You jerk! <laughs> I was waiting for you to come closer. <laughs> I see this. Okay. Um. Wow, that took a turn for the worst. I'm like, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get this. All right. Um, let's that was funny. Do that. Okay. Um. I will reveal this uh -huh. and try to see what the heck that. That is, is a trap. That is a trap. Mm -hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. I will reveal this and uh -huh. see what that is. That is a seven. A seven, okay. And now it's your turn. And I will now reveal that seven <laughs> to move two squares in any oh, direction. Oh, you can do that! Oh, I'm so stupid. No, you're fine. Oh, I'm so dumb. I just killed my own guy, That's so okay. you're, you're fine. Okay. Interesting. I will reveal and move two spaces this way. <gasps> oh, I forgot you could do that. Oh. That's your six, yes? That's awful, yeah. Nine. What is that? A nine. Nine. Ooh, nasty. You killed me. Okay. You have to move there. Oh, yeah. Mm hmm um. Mm hmm. All right, I'm gonna move up. I think. I'm gonna scout and see what this one is. That is a three. So your your two is dead. Um, I will do that. I'm gonna reveal. Okay, at your ten. And then here, and, uh -huh. attack and kill that. Yeah. You kill my three. Nice. There you go. Well done. Well done. Um. It's scary though, because I don't know what abilities you have there. You could have a slayer. I could. What happens if a ten lands on a trap again? Uh, you die. The only thing that can take out a trap are is dwarves. are dwarves. And no slayers, just the dwarves. Correct. The slayers can only take out a ten. Okay. And only if they land on it. Okay. It's crazy is what it is. Yeah, it is. Mm-hmm. You got this. Okay. 
take this. Okay. Move it back here. Gotcha. Ten. <laughs> cool. I will do this. I will reveal this as a 10, fly down here, and attack an adjacent space. That's your 9? Yeah. Lucky. You lucky dog, you. Mm -mm, you say so. <laughs> okay. Okay. I will reveal, fly, kill. Whatever that is. Oh, sorcerers. What is that? A sorcerer. A six. Oh. Dang. I forgot that you could do that. That dr that dragon is. Nasty. Yeah, it is. I mean, I know your Slayer's gone, so it's just a matter of... Okay, so you're trying to force a trade-off, I think, at this point. And no matter what I do, um, you're going to take it anyway, right? Um, well, here's the thing. I know that you've moved this, so I'm going to fly here and attack that. Whatever it is. The eight. The eight? Okay. Yeah, nasty. Um... Man, that's really good. Good stuff. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you re are you going to reveal an attack? Or are you, no. Are you trying oh, yeah, actually, yeah. Okay, yeah, I can do that, right? Yeah, you can, can force. I didn't know if you were going to. Okay. <laughs> Forcing a trade -off. That's hard. Like, you already took out half my people from that. <laughs> I'm going to reveal okay. the nine, okay. and I want to know what that is. It's a trap. It's a trap! Mm -hmm. Okay. So it's that doesn't kill you? No. Mm -hmm. No. All right. The nine just detects what enemy that is. Yeah. Okay. Um. Oh, I think I lost this. No, you're fine. I'm going to do that. It's a seven. Seven? Eight. Ah! I didn't think you had an eight! Oh my god, that's horrible. Darn! <laughs> that stings. Okay. Um... That's... I know what that is. Okay, so... You sure? It's a seven. You don't know that. <laughs> well don't... then, in that case, I'm gonna reveal it and move two spaces. Okay. okay. <laughs> You insist. Um, wow. Let's do that. I will reveal mm -hmm. and shoot that. You won. That your flag. My flag. Good job. So, what do you think of this version? This is harder. Is it harder? <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, I think it is. It's fun. I kind of liked it better than the classic. I liked it too. Like I, like I didn't think I would like it because <laughs> of how chaotic it would be. But it's very strategic. Yeah, it is. Like, once you get a handle on all the different abilities and what they do and what they can do for you, mm -hmm. like that elf was just murdering people and figuring. Oh, he was scouting for free basically without using my twos. Yeah, um, you killed my elf. I don't even remember. I have to watch the video again. I don't remember. <laughs> And it was good. You did really, really well. Yeah, I tried. Where do you think my flag was? Oh, um, somewhere in the bottom row. Yeah, typical. Like maybe one of those three. The bottom. One of these three. Yeah. Where was it? Trap. Three. Three. So it was there. Here. Yeah. Three. What was the other one? What was the next? This one. one? Yeah. Trap. What was the other one? 
flag. Oh! Had you done, I was waiting for you to do like this and attack. I would have been dead. I couldn't. But I know, but I you didn't scared. know what it was. Right. You don't I know what anything is. I was so tempted to just go across like with my ten. Well, you couldn't though because this entire line was, you have to land in no, a No, no, I know, I know. I'm saying that like I wanted to attack you one by one on each Oh, I see thing. what you're saying. But, but had you I hit this, I, this was a trap or yeah, no. Yeah. If you hit no that idea. three, you had, yeah, that could have been... It's typical for players to put traps in the back row yeah. around their flag or something, you know what I mean, to prevent that from happening. What I wanted to do too was even though, like I wanted to do that, I wanted to take my 10 and, and get that and if I did get hit by a trap, I wanted to take one of my dwarves and like maybe like, you know, get in there and, get in there and, and then take another 8 or 7 or 5 or whatever. What did you have game. left? And threes, threes. Three. You had the same idea as I did. Trap here, trap okay. here. I had a seven here, a stupid five here, a trap here. I had a trap here. I had a trap here and a trap here. And nice. My flag was here. My three, my three, my five. I don't know. I put all my dwarves in the bottom because I didn't think I'd need them yet. Right. No, that's typical. That's what I did. I didn't think I'd need them right away. Mm -hmm. Yeah, very good game. I that enjoyed it. Yeah. So, what did you think overall of the game, Stratego? It was okay. Um, I don't like moving just one spot. One spot. It's very limited. It's very chess-like. And I, even though I love chess, mm -hmm. I only like it for nostalgia reasons. I don't like like I don't I like see. actual chess. See, this was one of the first <laughs> strategy games I ever learned mm -hmm. back in the day. So, like, I really it's it's nostalgic, and I enjoy playing it. Yeah. Um. It's just a matter of just, you, you start with the same pieces, and because of that move one rule, like, you have to outsmart your opponent. Like, yeah. you have to get them to take bait uh, and, and kill themselves somehow, or just outmaneuver and different, like, it's all maneuvering, really. Yeah. It's and, difficult. And scouting. And you know me with maneuvering. I'm terrible maneuvering in X-Wings. Uh, I can't, I can't yeah. think, like, ahead. Like, uh -huh. I can't guess. 20 moves ahead is very hard for me. Mm -hmm. My brain is, just doesn't work that way. <laughs> right, I understand. You did very good, though. For your, this, you. this is your first couple of games. And this this advanced... This I consider this an advanced variant. Really? You know what I mean? Like I this, think it's, it makes it a little bit more fun. Oh, yeah. It's definitely more fun. It's more chaotic. It's more it's crazy. <laughs> well, it, it, it makes it more strategic and more fun at the same time, I think. Mm -hmm. I like so I, I don't know if I could ever go back to regular Stratego... <laughs> With knowing that I can do extra things yeah. like this, like that's like this opened up a whole new world for me. Is really, this digital? Is there a digital? Mm, only for the base game, not oh. for not for these special abilities, oh. which I know stinks. <laughs> All right, well that was Stratego Fire Nice. I don't know where you'll find it, folks. I'll put an Amazon link to a Stratego game. It may not be this exact. Co there are a gazillion renditions of Stratego on the market. So I can't guarantee that I'll find this exact one, um, but at the very least, put a link to the general board game in the below description. Just be warned that it may just be the regular game without the special abilities, but hey, if you're, if you're savvy enough, write down the, write down the abilities. Uh, I, I mean, if you want, I can... download the manual. Yeah, you can download, you can maybe download this manual or use my video to put together your own list. Use a regular set of Stratego pieces and just, you know, yeah. do it yourself. You don't need this exact set to incorporate these special abilities. So, you may not buy this exact copy, but you could copy the rules from this one and apply it to a different game uh, that you might have, a different rendition. So yeah, that was Stratego. If you guys haven't already, subscribed to us on Twitch and YouTube. That way you can stay up to date with any new content I've been to publish. This is Vincent Idalee. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you guys next time. Bye, guys.